Hello everyone and welcome to today's class and today's class is titled Cable Car Crisis. Let's move on to language focus. Ilbon. In the Alai Valley, however, things are a bit more, shall we say, adventurous. So for Ilbon, we can see the highlighted expression for today and that is shall we see. Use shall we see before making an understatement. I'm going to underline that. For example, the author wrote adventurous, but the real meaning was dangerous and scary, so it was an understatement. Okay, first we need to understand what an understatement is. But in this situation, there is also an element of sarcasm, bigum, in a lot of the uh, sentences when we say, shall we say. So I'm going to give you the example here because it's a very good example. Okay. Ray's singing voice is, shall we say, rather unique. Ray의 노래한 목소리는 좀 특이하다. Now, 특이하다 means special, unique. 근데 이런 경우에는 kind of 삐꼬다, sarcastic. So, in fact, 뭐, Ray는 노래를 잘 못합니다, 음치입니다. So, we're using a sarcastic term. And it's also the way you would say it. So, a natural native uh, English speaker would go, Ray's singing voice is, shall we say, rather unique. So if you look at the face of the speaker, if they're kind of looking unsure, it's usually meaning the opposite. Or, trying to get enough sleep with a newborn baby in the house is, shall we say, challenging. So, 집에서 갓 태어난 아기와 충분한 수명을 취하는 것은 어렵습니다. Okay, but, but, 하지만 현실적으로 각 태어난 아기를 집안에 두고 충분한 수명을 취하는 것은 매우 어렵습니다. So, in this situation, it's challenging, that's true. But in reality, it's extremely difficult. So there is an understatement and a little bit of sarcasm as well. So yes, shall we say, use in terms of being a little bit sarcastic, be a little bit uh, of an understatement. Let me just put this in here for you to remember. All right, let's look at Ibon now. Ibon. By some miracles, the third cable didn't break and the students were able to call for help. By some miracle is our next expression. And we use this expression to express something incredibly lucky has happened. Something incredibly lucky has happened. So, by some miracle, in Korean you could say like, um, 워신가의 기적으로 um, So, by some miracle Or, in a way, wouldn't be 100% uh, the translation, but 우연히 By chance but like in the terms of being lucky, all right? Is how I would explain how we define this. So example, I only studied for one night, but some, but by some miracle, I passed the test. 하룻밤만 공부했는데 기적적으로 시험에 합격했어요. So 
one night of studying or cramming uh, is not enough to really pass a test if you're not uh, prepared. However, by some miracle, by chance, I actually passed the test. So yes, luck has happened in this situation. Or by some miracle, Tom managed to escape from the sinking ship. Uh, 어떤 뭐 기적으로 톰은 침울하는 배에서 탈출할 수 있었다. So luckily, uh, Tom was able to escape from the sinking ship before he died. Well, before he could have died, should I say. So yes, by some miracle with uh, something incredibly lucky happening to you. Alright, now let's look at the language focus quiz. 1번 hmm is, shall we say, not my favourite hmm. So, shall we say, remember, was sort of like an understatement, 절제 된 표현, but with an element of sarcasm. 비고하다. Alright, so, hmm is, shall we say, not my favourite hmm. Okay, so let's say, chicken feet. Is, shall we say, not my favorite food. So, 닭발은 내가 좋아하는 음식이 아니다. 근데 현실은, like, 현실, reality, 저는 닭발은 너무 싫다. I really don't like 닭발. Because it's so spicy. 이번. Hmm, does some things that are, shall we say, a little hard to understand. The manager does some things that, shall we say, are a little hard to stand. So the understatement is like, manager는 좀 이해하기 어려운 일을 한다. 근데 reality, 현실, manager는 아주 이해하기 어려운 일들을 한다. Very difficult to understand. 3번, by some miracle. So, uh, 무엇인가의 기적으로 or 우연히 by chance, in pos if possible by some miracle, hmm, found a way to hmm. So, by some miracle uh, I found a way to, uh, to fix my computer uh, 기적으로 내 컴퓨터를 고칠 방법을 찾았다. I don't know how. Oops. I don't know how, but I managed to fix it. 4번. By some miracle, nobody noticed my purple hair. So, uh, 기적적으로 아무도 내 보라색 머리카락을 뭐 알아채지 못했어요. I mean, if someone walks in with purple hair and they don't notice it, that's a miracle. Especially if they're so used to them having different hair color. Alright, now let's move on to the further discussion. 1번 In general, do you think your country has good safety standards for transportation? Why or why not? 1번 쪽으로 당신은 당신의 나라가 교통수단에 대한 좋은 안전 기준을 가지고 있다고 생각하나요? 왜 혹은 왜 그렇지 않나요? In regards to public transportation, I would definitely say that South Korea has a very safe uh, transportation. In regards to buildings, there has been a lot of controversy surrounded by, uh, surrounding brand new buildings for residents, like apartment buildings and just office buildings in general. As we know, South Korea is a very fast developing country, and especially when it comes to infrastructure. So I question whether a lot of the infrastructure in South Korea is safe, but in regards to transportation, we haven't heard many incidences where something has failed. Obviously, from time to time, a subway might break down. And we did have situations, I think it was like, what, 
almost six or seven years ago where on line two they collided together but that wasn't due to a uh, I think that wasn't due to a, a mechanical failure I think it was due to a communication failure either way I think our transportation is quite good Ibon in the future what modes of transportation could replace cable cars uh, in places like Ari Valley Oh, okay, that's an interesting question. Uh, 미래, 뭐, 아리, 발리, 같은 곳에서 케이블 카를, uh, 대체할 수 있는 교통 수단은, 수단은 무엇일까요? Um, I don't know if you could replace the same sort of, um, transportation as, I think, like, a substitute for cable cars, should I say. Um, because cable cars are usually there to take you up a mountain and take you down a mountain, right? Or take you from one place to another as a ride. Um, it's a relatively cheap investment in compared to maybe using flying cars or transportation or whatever like that. Um, what they could do instead is just update the cable cars. Uh, completely start from the bottom again start from uh, uh, taking down all the old cable cars and just putting up new safe ones. Um, that was the only thing that I can imagine that they should replace. And I think that would be a better solution in regards to budget wise as well. Anyway, that wraps it up for today and I'll see you on the next class. Serene. Serene. Scenic. Scenic. Piece together. Piece together. Scrap metal. Scrap metal. Midway. Midway. Grim. Grim.